The fervor of the boys from VG Sumerians was in evidence from the very start. The match pass, displaying fervor, precision, and the spirit of Sumeria. The men in yellow looking to make history today. Tapo started the day in third place and they were engaged in a ding dong battle throughout the day with presentation. Yes, from the first race, there was great excitement and close competition. Jabari Daniel outran Gillard of Tapo and Roseman to go on to win the gold. Then, the nippiest tribe of DeAndre Norbert beat his competitors Leslie and Seraphim into second and third place. In Division 3, Tapon started getting warm. Joseph of Tapon edging out Dale Elliott of presentation with Tapon Shari placing third. In Division 2, the Simon of Rodney decimated the field, leaving Oji of Ab and St. Louis of Tapon in his way. In Division 1, yet in the approved fashion and flawless technique, Miguel Shalry pulled away to win cold ahead of Flat from Prez and Gosri of Rodney. Division 3, 800 meters. Things were really heating up with the lead being exchanged on several occasions. But the sprint and strategy of Seville of Tapon won in the gold, beating off this competition with Lewis and Duncan both having to share the medal. In the 800 meters, Division 1, presentation ensured they remained in the battle with Donai of Prez beating off Mata of Abs and James of Tapper, who came in third. In the 80 meters, Division 5 saw the powerhouse of sprinting from Tapper that made the difference and brought them back into the lead. The engine moved into top gear. Roseman, like a flash, went on to win gold with James of Abs and Joseph of Tapper behind in silver and bronze. 100 meters, Division 4. Prez captured gold through Norbert and Tyler of Tapo in the number two spot, and Seraphim placed third from Am. In Division 3, again, Prez versus Tapo, very much the story of the day. Dale Elliott of presentation now in the lead at one point, but Tapo's Azari Joseph powered past to win gold, and Tapo Cup bronze with Shelly. Division 2, the Tapon show continued. There we saw there was no catching in Tristan Lionel with Simon of Rodney and Francis of Tapon following after him. And then the title of the fastest college boy was never in doubt as Miguel Shari dominated. Yes, remember the name, Miguel Shari. Classy sprinting with his way to gold always very clear. The silver went to Pelage and Gabriel of Rodney came in third. Then presentation bounced back into the running in the longer distances, earning some valuable victory. Division 3, Joseph of Abercrombie, he beat Lendo and Philip. There was a great show of sportsmanship and the Sumerian spirit, with various house members helping the rivals. Here in the relay, Tapo, with a strong leg from Lendo, held steady to go on to win the gold in that division for the relay. The Tapo boys breaking the long-standing record for the junior relay. Really. 
and then the going was still tough with presentation winning ahead of Rodney. Then the region three tap on held steady and a no nonsense mood, almost mechanical, romping home to another goal for the yellow shirt. Yes, but this time it was the turn of Rodney. A uh, victory perhaps, but he prevailed despite the best efforts of Shalry. And a good display in the 4x400. Great recovery after dropping the baton on the second leg. Tapper would bounce back to second place. And then power on to the victory. And of course, the celebration understandably erupted. Wonderful little moment. Sister Jessie, one of the favorites on the staff of St. Mary's College, she ran. She wasn't at all a winner past the tape, but in the eyes and the spirits of the college boys, Sister Jessie was their winner and they ushered her past the finish line. Fine moment to do. The final points to be decided in tug of war. Tapo making it to the finals. That was enough to win the championship and then the celebration. Memorable meet by SMC, an epic contest, Tapon edging out presentation by one point.